job when the pandemic hit, and then he lost his financing to buy his dream home. Adding insult to injury, the builder then refused to return his $13,500 down payment, and that's when he knew he'd better call banking. And tonight, Shannon's getting results. During normal circumstances, you can expect to lose your deposit if your financing falls through. But what this builder decided to do just didn't seem right during a national emergency. Kind of shocked by the lack of human compassion here, you know. Weeks before closing on this new home in the beautiful Epperson Lagoon community in Wesley Chapel, Russell Keitel got devastating news. The virus started to spread and panic set in, and I lost my job. Understandably, his financing fell through, but then mega builder DR Horton decided to keep his $13,500 down payment. Stand during normal times, so this would be the, the norm, but you know, to, to keep a deposit. But I just, what's going on now, it's just to me, it's it's un, you know, unimaginable that they, they would do something like this. Russell, who works as a roadie for concerts across the country, needs the money for his family. It won't make or break them, DR Horton. It won't make or break them. This will devastate me financially. He knew he'd better call Bankin. I called the builder's regional office. But these are not normal circumstances, and it seems like it's just not right that this man now is without his job, without being able to buy the home, and without $13,000. That he needs to pay bills. I called the Texas headquarters and sent an email. That did the trick. Within hours, DR Horton contacted me and thanked me for bringing this to their attention, and they promised to return all of the money to Russell. I will stay on this until Russell receives every penny. I'm Shannon Binken, eight on your side. And if you have a problem that needs solving, you better call Binken. You can reach her on Facebook at WFLA Shannon or give her a call at 1 